Okay. And I'm going to bring your gown up so we can get a good view of your arms, so we can look at the upper extremity here. Okay. You can just relax your shoulders. First, I'm just going to inspect the skin for any signs of lesions, discoloration, and look at the color and um, texture. And then go ahead and palpate the landmark, starting with the clavicle to the acromion clavicular joint, coracoid process, and the bicipital groove. And we'll do the same on the other side. Okay, and then triceps and biceps. And then look at the epitrochlear nodes and brachial pulse. Lateral and medial epicondyles and the olecranon process. And down to the radial and ulnar styloids. Do a general inspection of the carpal bones, MCP joints. PIP joints and DIP joints. Okay, and the same on the other side. Lecranon process. Styloids. Carpals. MCP joints, and PIP and DIP. Okay, everything appears to be healthy and normal. So now we're gonna take a look at the uh, range of motion of your upper extremity. Okay. So with your hands down in front here, have you bring them all the way up above your head, and all the way back and behind you. Good, and now with your palms to your side, bring them up all the way above your head, for abduction and all the way back down and cross in front for adduction, good. And now for external rotation, just have you bring your hands up behind your head and internal rotation back behind your back. Good, okay, and now range of motion against resistance. Bring your hands out to the side. Don't let me push them down, okay, and don't let me pull them up. Good, very good, okay. Now bring your fists to your shoulders and back down again, looking at range of motion of the elbow, and up to your shoulders again. Don't let me pull them away from your shoulder. Good, and don't let me push them towards your shoulder. Excellent, good. Now with your elbows at your sides, bring your hands out in front like this. Have you bring your wrists up, down. Bring your thumbs in toward radial deviation and away, ulnar deviation, good. And again, bring your wrists up, and don't let me push them down, looking at wrist Range of motion against resistance and bring them back down. Don't let me pull them up. Good, okay. Now spread your fingers as far apart as you can and don't let me bring them together. Excellent, and now finally, just have you make a fist and grab my finger, squeeze as hard as you can. Excellent, good. And that completes the uh, examination of the upper extremity.